are you buying Robux or redeeming a gift card soon? Well, use code MEGANPLAYS while doing so to help support the channel. But mom, why can't we go up to the surface all the way? I mean, I think that there's a mall up there, a school, a food court. Like, can you just even imagine everything that's out there? Look, I know it all sounds fun and the human activities are full of bright lights and fun things to do, but you have to understand that those things just aren't for merfolk like us. The humans don't understand us and you have to keep yourself safe. Has anybody even tried to go communicate with the humans? I mean, who knows? Maybe we could all just coexist. I mean, if you would like to hear from your father the tale of your great-great-great-great-great-mer-grandfather and how his adventure went... No, we do not want to hear that again, okay? That's such a long story. Well, I'm going to tell you the story, okay? So he went on land one day thinking, oh, I can just go on land like this, and now I'm on land. And then he died of sun poisoning. I thought you said that he died because he was turned into fish sticks. Uh, well, yeah, because once you die, then everyone becomes a fish stick. Didn't you tell Jimmy that he died because he decided to go paragliding and then, like, the parachute didn't open or something? Your story keeps on changing. Well, what is this, an interrogation? I don't know. Fine, I guess we could just all head home and eat, you know, kelp for dinner again. <sighs> Since you guys seem to want to go exploring, we will let you do as many laps around the lake as you want. Feel free to bring home as many shells and, you know, pretty pearls, but we'll go ahead head back and get some dinner okay oh wow mother you are so gracious i cannot wait to explore the very same lake that we've always explored good you should be grateful for what we have you heard her let's go find some shells i am sick of exploring the lake i'm not having fun here okay that was a joke i'm not having fun okay well jimmy what are we gonna do we can't we can't go above the surface we you have your iPad in water? I don't... Megan, I've been using this iPad to control and talk to other humans, and they all seem very cool. They're not as scary as you soon. But do they know that you're a merfolk? Of course not, Megan, but here's the thing. I don't care, okay? They're not going to kill, okay? Because they're my friends. I pay Robux for them, okay? Why don't we go out and just try to explore? Uh, Jimmy, I just don't think that's a good idea. I think I'm, I'm going to I'm gonna head back this way, and you should just look for some seashells, okay? Oh, my God, me, you're so scary. You can't go little stupid. I'm going to... <sighs> okay, so let's find a pink one or... Jimmy! Jimmy, where are you going? You're not supposed to be up on land like that. Megan, okay, nothing's happening. I'm not dying. I'm not physics, okay? The lying to you! Uh, okay, uh, okay. If you're gonna be out here, I at least have to protect you because, you know... Oh! Oh my gosh, your skin! Hey, what the heck? What the heck is happening? I don't know. You just turned into, like, a, a normal-looking boy. Oh my gosh, I think... Hey, my skin color just changed too. What do you think? Do I do I look normal? Do I look pink? Oh, you're kind of ugly, but the thing is, there's nothing can change that. Let's get going. This is gonna be so much fun, but we do have to be back before nighttime. <sighs> Our day in Brookhaven has been so much fun. I mean, we got ice cream, we went shopping, we went to the movies, and now a really nice time settling and staring at this beautiful pool in front of us. We just have to be really careful not to go near it. This was the best day of my entire life. I cannot believe mother and father did not want us to explore. We're gonna have to head home soon and maybe we can tell them about how good the outside world is. Hey, um, are you guys new? I've never seen you around here before. Oh, um, yeah. My name is Megan, and this is my little brother, Jimmy. It's great to meet you. Hmm, well, it's nice to meet you, too. Did you guys just move here? Yeah, we did. Um, from... We uh, transferred from a different city called, um, uh, um... Lake, Lake Topia. I've never heard of Lake Topia before. What's with your little brother's hair? It's like super crazy. Okay, then you have like an ice cream cone on your head and you're gonna talk about my hair? I don't think so. Listen, this is a designer hat, okay? And everyone at Brookhaven knows that my mayor, the dad, bought this for me. You look like a melted strawberry cone on the concrete. You are very gross. Jimmy, stop, stop. Megan, you cannot let these people destroy you, okay? I've been trolled on Roblox servers, and I know how to fight back. But this is not a Roblox server, Jimmy. This is real life. And you with the glasses. You sound like an idiot. I haven't even spoken. Yeah, exactly. Does your house not even have any water? Because you guys stink. Like, like fish. Gross. Ew, it smells so bad. I didn't realize how bad he smelled. Maybe we should throw them in the water. No, okay. No, wait, 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 wait. Stop, Jimmy. Jimmy does not like getting picked up. Hey, what is all the commotion over here? What do you want, Cindy? Um, well, you know, I kind of keep watch around these parts, and it seems like you're just about to throw him into the water. The 
that's because he insulted my hat, and then we found out they were stinky, so I thought he could get a bath. Okay, well, he can get a bath at his house, and yeah, the hat kind of looks a little stupid. I'm gonna go tell my dad! Cindy, you are my superhero! You are protecting me! I now owe you Megan's life! Cindy, thank you so much for protecting me and my brother. I don't know where we would be without you. He's actually kind of um allergic to water, and he can't swim, so he would have drowned and had an allergic reaction. So thank you so much for saving him. Do you guys want to hang out tomorrow? Sure, that actually sounds really fun. You know, we've had a lot of fun in this new town, but we haven't really made any friends yet. Uh, I'm really glad to have met you. Well, yeah, it was nice to meet you guys, too. Well, I'll see you guys tomorrow, then. All right, bye! Darn it, it's it's nighttime. We have to get back right now. We're gonna be in so much trouble. I wouldn't doubt if Mom and Dad were up on the shore just waiting for us to come back. No, no, no. Oh, my gosh. Okay, they're right there. There you are. Where have you two been? Just right here on this beach hanging out and it looks like you let your skin dry up too would you two get back in the water i cannot believe you went to the surface after hearing the story about your great 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 bird grandfather yeah and you didn't even notice i got a new shirt well I, i'm sorry the the stories just seemed a little bit unclear and it's all megan's fault okay she forced me okay i did not want to go mother you know me zimmy's a very good boy he did not break no wood <sighs> i'm so sorry we just really wanted to see what life was like out there and honestly it wasn't too bad Every, uh, everyone was really nice there was a, a little bit of an incident but you know it, it wasn't a really big deal or anything like that an incident do you do you mean people saw you i mean yeah we talked to a ton of people they were all really nice weren't they jimmy they were very nice to me okay i'm pretty sure this girl has got a crush on me if they've seen your faces and then they see you in the water they're going to know that something is up and that the merfolk live in this lake no one's gonna know when we didn't get into the pool i mean jimmy was almost thrown in by some bullies but we handled it and then it didn't happen no i i can't bear this the thought of you possibly going back tomorrow it just makes me sick you're going to your grandparents in the ocean no come on don't send us to grandma and grandpa's house they smell like kelp and seaweed and there are sharks there okay it's much more dangerous than the ocean than in Brookhaven, okay there are sharks there I don't want to hear any more discussion about this. It's decided. You're going to the ocean tomorrow. And for now, we're going home. Yeah, the only thing I want to hear is compliments about my shirt. You know what, Dad? Your shirt is the stupidest shirt I've ever seen. How dare you let me go to the grandma's? All right, well, it looks like I just have to send off the messenger eel to your grandparents and everything is settled. Now, I have to go and put this in the river to go to the ocean, so don't go anywhere. Jimmy, I feel like we're in so much trouble, but I don't want to go away to Grandma and Grandpa's house. I feel like we just barely got a taste of what it's like out there. Oh, Megan, it is a fattest thing. I'm going to go to that sucky ocean, okay? I am not leaving Brookhaven. I'm going to become a real boy. Okay, yeah, maybe we should try to devise a plan to get out of here. Here. I mean, mom is gone. Dad's distracted with his chest hair and new shirt. So maybe if we can climb up to the surface, uh, we can hide out at a diner or a hotel or something like that until the next morning. I just Googled it, okay? There was a motel only like a mile away, okay? So we can totally do this. I'm not scared. Are you scared? Because I am a total big boy. I can definitely do this. No, I'm I'm definitely not scared. Come on, Jimmy. Okay, Megan, follow me if you're scared, okay? I can take care of this. <sighs> okay, it's almost morning, and maybe we can go meet up with that girl that we met. What was her name? Cindy, right? Cindy, my girlfriend. Yeah, we could probably definitely meet up with her. I don't know. I I don't think that she's your girlfriend. I, I think that maybe I you're a little bit mistaken there. Megan, you do not understand the human culture, okay? Once you save a man, that man is yours for life. <sighs> okay, sure, whatever you say. Why have we been watching this panda on a seahorse for, like, hours now? Like, it's just playing on an infant. A loop. Man, they have a lot of amazing souls here in Brookhaven, okay? This is culture, baby. You need to learn the ways of human. Come on, let's go find Cindy. I'm so excited because maybe we can even like go to school with her today or something. School, yeah. I heard about that on my iPad. And that sounds pretty boring, but I guess we can do it so I can see Cindy. <laughs> So, Cindy, I was wondering if maybe we could go to school with you. I mean, I'm not very good at math or English or science or anything, but uh, I'm pretty good at uh, oceanography. Wait, so you guys are new to town, but you're not signed up for school yet? No, not yet. Our, our parents wanted to homeschool us, but I thought it'd be really fun to go to a public school. 
Oh, well, we can get you signed up. We can go walk over to the school in a little bit if you want. Cindy, you are just the greatest girlfriend Timmy could ever ask for. Timmy does have a lot of other girlfriends. Some fourth quarter fifth. But here's the thing. You're his favorite girl. Jimmy, there's the... Um, the, I couldn't help but overhear that you're planning on going to school with us now. Um, yeah, I thought it'd be really fun to get involved and maybe like join some school sports and hang out with the basketball team, you know, normal things. I am in charge of all of those things and I can't have a new girl getting in my way. So, sorry about this, but... Ah! Oh no, my skin! Uh, don't look, okay, don't look! Are you a mermaid? No! Definitely not. Mermaids? Right here in Brookhaven? And you just moved here? Wait, 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 wait. So, are you... Your serious mermaids are real? They're like my favorite thing ever. What? I thought... I thought that humans hated merfolk. I thought that, you know, if you found out that we were mermaids, you guys would have our heads on a trident. I think it's so cool. I mean, I would give anything to have peak skin. It's my favorite color. Yeah, and people like mermaids. So there's like movies and books and there's a bunch of stuff off of it. Holy cow, so wait, Cindy, you're telling me that you like mermaids? Uh, well, maybe. Well, check these apples out, baby. I am also a little mermaid. One second, the skin has to get absorbed in the water. Okay, one second, it's coming. Yeah. Uh, see? Jimmy, why'd you make those noises? That doesn't... Megan, because I have automatic effect, okay? They think I'm a merman. Well, it's really great to hear that you guys actually like merfolk. I'm not gonna lie. We were really afraid that we wouldn't be accepted here in Brookhaven, but it's really nice to know that everybody can coexist together and that you're not so mad at us anymore. Yeah, you guys are very lucky because I had a game of fourth water fifth ready to attack you the moment that you stepped within an inch of the water. Well, the good news is, is I think you guys can get signed up for school now. As long as everybody's willing to keep our secret, I'm sure that me and Jimmy will have a very amazing life here in Brookhaven. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you loved it, do not forget to hashtag stay PG, stay kind, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!